Hi, my name is Ronit Mukherjee and I'm an Applications Engineer for Go Engineer. In today's quick tip video, we're going to be discussing a new feature in 2016 SOLIDWORKS Simulation called Non-Touching Faces. Here, I have a solid part uh, model of a weldment structure and as you can see, there's uh, gaps between all these weldments. Uh, maybe these gaps were left for welding purposes. Um, we're running a simple stress calculation analysis on this where we're going to apply some forces on the top and it's fixed in the bottom. If I was to run this study, uh, SOLIDWORKS is going, should fail and should say, uh, it should give us an error uh, uh, regarding the model is unstable and uh, check that you have applied adequate fixtures to stabilize this model. So basically things are flying, in the, uh, uh, things are flying around. Now in 2016, you have the option of non-touching faces, which is located under your bonded global contact. If you edit that definition, you'll have a checkbox down here. And if you check that box, you get to give uh, a maximum clearance. In this case, we'll just use two millimeters and we'll run this analysis. Now, uh, with this new 2016 feature, SOLIDWORKS should be able to calculate, uh, uh, should be able to run this analysis and uh, we should be able to get our uh, stress uh, displacement and uh, factor of safety results. Since it's not a too heavy of an analysis, it runs right away, and uh, here are our stress values. Of course, this deformation scale is at 67 times, so some displacement results right here, and our factor of safety uh, right here at 1.9. Okay, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you for watching.